I am jogging in the park. They are walking the dog. These are examples of the present continuous tense. Let's run back to the classroom and talk about it. Welcome back. Today we're going to talk about the present continuous. If you would like to review present simple tense, just pause the video here and check out the lesson we made. The link will appear right about here. Also, please like and subscribe to help us grow and reach more people. Let's get started. The present continuous is used to talk about continued actions that are happening in the present moment. It is formed with the be verb and a present participle. Let's explain through an example. The present continuous is used to describe a current and continued action. This is the present simple tense. It describes a repeated action. The present continuous uses the verb form be. This is the present continuous. It describes what is happening right now. Let's look at how to form present continuous sentences. When we are forming the present continuous, the be verb form changes with the subject. I am, he is, she is, it is, you are, we are, they are. This is the present participle. What is a participle? A participle is a word based off of a verb that expresses a state of being, ending in a present tense or past tense that functions as an adjective. Present participles follow the same spelling rules as gerunds. If you would like to know more about gerunds, check out our video we made. It is very short and easy to understand. Let's look at some examples. I am cooking food. We are walking the rabbit. He is washing the car. They are drinking coffee. They're talking on their phones. He's relaxing today. Joe is exercising on the treadmill. It's raining outside. I'm shopping for bread. They're baking fresh bread at this bakery. The shop isn't open now, but it's opening soon. It's raining a lot now. With present participles, there are some spelling rules. The present participle is formed by adding the ing to the base form of the verb. Some participles have slightly different spelling rules. Add the ing ending to form regular present participles. If the last letter of the word is e, leave out the e and add the ing. If the last letters of the word are IE, then change the IE to Y. If the last letters are a consonant vowel consonant combination and the final syllable is stressed, double the last letter. Double the last letter unless the word ends with W, X, or Y. Let's look at some examples while I wait. I am cutting vegetables. Erin is writing an email. She is shopping for shoes. They are opening the store soon. The last letter does not have to be doubled because the final syllable is not stressed. She is baking bread. He is tying his shoes. Action verbs doing words can be used in simple and continuous forms. State verbs, state of being, 
are not usually used in continuous forms. Is it going to rain? Are they playing on the playground? Is she cycling to work? These are examples of questions in the present continuous. Let's work through questions in the present continuous through an example. To form questions in the present continuous, swap the subject and the verb form be. He is the subject. In a question, the verb moves to the start of the sentence. The action is happening right now. Let's look at how to form present continuous questions. Am I? Is he? Is she? Is it? Are you? Are we? Are they? Let's look at some examples. Are they playing in the park? Is she cycling to work? Are they eating ice cream? Is he working late? Where are we going today? Are you coming to the park? Question words such as what, where, and how can be used before the verb to form open questions. What are you eating for dinner? Is it raining outside? It isn't raining anymore. I'm not hungry. Are you hungry? The present continuous negative follows the same rules as the present simple negative. Let's go look at how to form the present continuous negative. To make the negative form of the present continuous, just add not after the be verb. I am not. He is not. She is not. It is not. You are not. We are not. They are not. Let's see some examples. He isn't eating his food. They aren't going outside today. She isn't washing her clothes. They aren't walking the rabbit. You aren't working hard today. We aren't walking to work today. We aren't cooking this weekend. Joe isn't reading his book. That was a long lesson. We covered a lot of topics. We covered the present continuous, how to form present continuous questions, and the present continuous negatives. I hope that you have a better understanding of the present continuous tense. Now you can go out and start making some present continuous sentences. See you next time!